do this, David. Uh, just gonna walk around a little bit. Quite a few people here. I, I kind of expected that. Just a lot more today than what I expected. This is actually uh, the third time I'm there. Third time that I have ever been uh, to uh, the ocean. I know it probably sounds kind of sad, but. I just never really took the time to go out and just take a vacation because I'm so used to having to work all the time and that's why I came out here to San Diego to try to, I uh, went to a convention on how I can try to improve, you know, my efforts and my skills with having a a home business that is an online business so that hopefully I can just be able to get all of my income from there that's my ultimate goal anyway that way I can try to enjoy life for a change on just I, I think I've just spent too much time trying to help others and take care of others that I just completely neglected my own life and uh, whether it be others in my personal life or working so much to try to help somebody else have their vacation and their nice home you know aka a, a job and there's just like hardly anything left for myself. I mean, I, I come home from work and I just have no energy. And right now I'm in the middle of having a, about 12 days off and just instantly I can tell the difference in the way I feel when I have that time for myself. It's just refreshing. I just feel so much more rejuvenated and I just feel like I have more sanity. Uh, I mean, I, I still have a long way to go in terms of trying to uh, trying to work on my mindset. I mean, there's always that lingering effect of all the years of, of struggling and uh, running into a lot of hurt and a lot of pain. You know, a lot of hurt and pain. You know, from my own my own perception. And I say that because, you know, everybody has a, a different perception of what is pain and what is hurt to them. I mean, the experiences that I have, you know, would probably be nothing for somebody else. You know, it would be no big deal. And whereas, you know, the same thing vice versa. So, uh, I'm trying to work on my mindset and I need times like this to rejuvenate and to try to heal and to try to focus on the things that really do matter.
and that is, you know, family and myself and people that I love, you know, including friends. Because if you really look at the whole picture, it's just, we get so caught up into uh, the little things in life, and what I mean, just the trivial things, that is, and things that don't matter that we forget about where we came from and about what we have here. As for the business, I think people are so used to trying to <coughs> get rich quick or have overnight success and you know and people get frustrated and they, when they don't get that instant success. And I think if there's one analogy that I would use is Look at this, this whole entire planet. I mean, this, this Earth is beautiful the way it is now, but it didn't become this way overnight. You know, whether it be the ocean, you know, the mountains, or, or, or you know, all, all your, uh, you know, the forests and plantations, just whatever it is that you find beautiful of this planet, that didn't happen overnight. That took millions of years to evolve and to develop. And, and I think if you can try to develop that kind of a mindset with your personal life, with your spirituality, uh, you know, whatever it is that, that you can do to connect with your inner self, you know, that takes time to really develop. And that's something that I need to be patient with. But I think I've just been so busy worrying more about other people that I just have never had any opportunity to focus on myself. I just... In, in a way, I feel like I'm 20 years behind in terms of maturity. But anyways, I don't want to make this too long. But I am really enjoying this and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Bye bye.